All right guys, that time of week again. It is Thursday, which means another video. Welcome back to my channel. Here we are in Croatia. It is 7 p.m. at night, and I'm gonna take you through a workout that I like to do. You guys know I love HIIT training, high intensity, high intensity interval training, and I love sprinting too. Uh, specifically, hill sprints. I think it's a great way to smash calories and get an awesome workout in quick. But I'm gonna tell you five ways that you can use a hill other than plain old sprints. So let's go head to the hill and get into it. So here we are, we're at a hill uh, close to where we're staying. It is about 80 meters long and pretty steep. As I mentioned, hill sprints are great, but I want to show you guys a bit of variety. So I'm gonna show you five different exercises that you can do on any hill. So I've just done my warm up. I've ran here and I've done a few runs up at about 50, 60% just normal jogging. So the first exercise I'm gonna do is running backwards. As fast as I can, obviously you've got to be a little bit careful, but it works on different muscle groups than if you're just going that frontal direction, going backwards, puts a bit more pressure on the quads, and it uses the muscles running along the front of your shins. This is what I'm going to do. I also find that it really works, uh, your calves a lot more, and as I said, a great variation using different muscles than running forward. The next one we're gonna do is side shuttles. This is a lateral movement up there. Here we go. strides. Uh, obviously mix it up so you do 50-50 on each side. Next one I'm doing is high knee bounding up the hill. knee bounding you notice it is called high knee bounding so you want to get the knees up high so you're going for height but you're also going for distance so it really works on explosive power because you're working up an incline as well of course flat ground this works just as well I'm going to show you exercise number four is going to be frog jumps up this incline jumps really good one for the glutes and the hamstrings I'm going to take you through the last one it is jumping lunges up the hill uh, if you find this too difficult or puts too much pressure on your knees you can just do walking lunges you're gonna get the great same result by now your legs should be really burning I'm feeling it it's the last of the five exercises let's do it done guys for the reps sets I did eight times 30 second efforts so you don't always have to worry about distance if you don't have a hill uh, go off the time so it was 30 seconds eight times I rested one for one ratio so 30 seconds on walked back 30 seconds go again and I did one minute break between each exercise there were five different exercises for you to go 
So I hope you give that a try, mix it into your training. If you're sick of ordinary sprints or working on a flat ground, then you hit a hill, hit an incline, and try these different exercises. It is a full on leg workout, I can promise you that. Give this video a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments what you thought of the workout, what you'd love to see next. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There is a new video every Thursday, and I will see you next week.